Hey guys, what's up? Back with another video and today we are taking a look at a brand new shoe to review. As you can see, this is the Kobe 9 Elite Low. The colorway is Hyper Grape White and Cave Purple. Suggested retail was $200. I'm going to open these up, but first if you could hit that like button, it does go a long way in helping out my channel and lets you know that you guys are enjoying the video. But anyway, I'm going to take these right out of the box so we can get into the review. All right guys, so these are the Kobe 9 Elite Low. Uh, these were called the Hyper Grapes or the Moonwalkers or more commonly the Michael Jacksons. These released a few weeks ago. Uh, they were fairly popular. The Kobe 9 Elite Low has been really popular. Just the two colorways that we've seen, everyone has gravitated towards those colorways. Um, but these sold out online. I originally did not pick them up online. You know, I felt uh, $200, I can spend it other places. There's a lot of LeBron 11s that I want to go back and get. So I just didn't pick them up. And I saw videos on them, I'm like, you know what, they're nice, but still not worth the 200 bucks. And then I went to the Mall of America on the 19th, which was a week after they came out, and they were actually still sitting there. And they are amazing in person. Pictures do not do these justice, video does not do them justice, hopefully I can try and do them justice in this video, but they are, oops, dropped the shoe, they are amazing in person, just the awesome flying of material all over the place, crazy purple, silver swoosh, not to mention this moonwalker bottom, obviously this is the inspiration for the nickname, the Moonwalker slash Michael Jackson, because Michael Jackson obviously did the moonwalk. Uh, if you guys haven't ever seen that, just search Michael Jackson moonwalk for some of the younger viewers that may not uh, remember Michael Jackson doing stuff. So uh, yeah, just Google moonwalk Michael Jackson and you'll see it is pretty crazy. But anyway, starting off on the bottom here, we have the uh, pressure map of the foot in a translucent clear. It's sort of icy blue and sort of just clear at the same time. It's a light tint of blue. And then you obviously have your moon print underneath the outsole. And then uh, you have your purple Kobe Suzuko logo hit right there. The midsole is basically just entirely black. You do have your two carbon fiber uh, shank plates right here and right there. Same deal on the medial side, you only have one carbon fiber shank plate this time though, but the same black midsole. And right here on the heel, you do have the Kobe logo. The rest of the upper is this awesome purple flannet material as I mentioned before. There are different shades of purple, hits of black underneath, uh, over here as you can see. And of course you have this awesome metallic silver swoosh. Now this isn't gonna come off or anything. I know in pictures it looked like it might like flake off over time because it's just on top of a fly, uh, on top of a fly net material, but this is on pretty solid and it's not gonna be falling off or anything, so don't worry about that. The tongue is that pro torch that we saw on the regular Kobe 9 Elite, the high version. And the top of the tongue is this very thick purple tongue, it's nice, cush, and padded, and you have this big white Kobe logo right here with your black Kobe signature. The sock liner is all black with the insole being purple with those little spikes all over it as you guys can see. And on the heel you have your nine stripes right there to represent his ninth shoe. 